Hey guys, how's your day going? My day's been great because I've been out on the pull. Just go see what I pulled? Come on, let's have a look. Well guys, this is what I pulled. Look at that beautiful, big bunch of big red, beautiful beetroots. Ooh. There's plenty more in the bed here. Some bigger than others. There's a couple more ready to come out. Let's have a look, see if we can find one. Nice big juicy one. Ooh. Ah, look at him. He looks about ready, doesn't he? Excellent. We're going to brush these off now. Take them indoors. Boil them up and pickle them. So let's see how it's done. Well, I was just wheelbarrowing this load down the drive and I stopped to admire these beautiful roses. Look at these. All the way long, miles and miles of roses. Oh, very pretty. Let's have a sniff. Oh, lovely. Right, that's enough of that. Let's get this beetroot boiled. Just trim the roots off outside to save any mess. That lot be going on the compost tape. Here we go. Right, everybody, back of the house now. So I'm going to need a bit of a wash. All I'm going to do, cut the heads off, cut the roots off. In they go. Boil this for 20 minutes, half hour. I'll be ready to get them in the vinegar. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see how we're getting on in the pan. Oh, boiling away nicely. Won't be long. Hey guys, here we are at the grand finale. So we let our beetroot cool off. We peeled it. We we'll see how to layer. It just rubs off in your hands. So what we do now? Chop up. Throw them in your jar. Pack it right to the top. That's enough. And cover it in vinegar. I've used Sarsen's pickling vinegar just because it's pre spiced and it's, it's easier. But uh, you can um, use normal vinegar as long as it's got good acidity to preserve the beetroot. So 5% or over and spice it yourself if you like. So stick that in. Oh, here we are. Vinegar on top. A lot of people like to warm the vinegar up and dissolve some sugar in, but I find it sweet enough for me anyway. Beetroot, but there you are, guys. Seal on, like so. Job done. So we leave that for a couple of weeks before we tuck into it, give it a chance for the vinegar to penetrate into the beetroot. So that's our folks. So let me know what you think. Um, how do you do yours? And uh, we'll see you next time. Take care, everybody.